it's not on. Right, I've start over again. I'm sat in front of the Royal Courts of Justice. I'm resting my feet and I'm thinking of the top of my head that I might have to decide on what my next moves are in terms of what's been what has been happening to me the past four years here in England, London, United States and how my life has been changed. My life was changed beyond recognition to the point I'm this person. But thanks to a very lovely, lovely, lovely lady, barrister Sally Robertson, who stood by me and helped me despite the fact she said she was not gonna take the case. She's just confirmed that her daughter suffers from chronic anxiety or I don't know if she did say chronic anxiety or she did just say anxiety but whatever it is so she said she understands my situation you know because I'm just thinking about the drastic measures after everything's been presented and the way the employment laws or criminal, criminal laws in, in, in particular are stacked against a lay person like myself who like with me I fall to pieces I don't perform except in the background and for them to use the law against a person like me is just diabolical so I'm thinking what will my next move be what will be the next move on the agenda so yes I'm going home I'm walking my daily exercise yeah and see I have all my all my thingy did this battery run out no it didn't so this is my thingy that I've got today on my wrist this morning I was leaving there was no current in my or electric electric in my sockets until my my trusted friend helped me out. So which road is best? Do I go around there? No, I'll go across here. Here is more of a more viable route. So I'm going to do the walking again. I'm going to switch this thing off and get a move on because I've had enough and it's not over yet. It's not over yet. So it's another, I don't know how long it's gonna take, but I have to get things in order by the 2nd of May and then start all over again. So I was thinking it would be, it would be finished by the time for me to celebrate my 59th birthday but nah I doubt very much it's not there's not an end in sight yet for this so I'm just taking my way home and hope for the best yeah so I have to tell you I learned that caveat is a catch yeah so I have to go work out how to avoid avoid the caveats the catches, yeah, the catches, the catches that are in laws and legislation that stitch you up. That's why Arwin McKen of Voice the Union told me that there was nothing to be done about what Leaf done to me because it's written in the contract. Okay, that's what I was told. So I'm going to sign off now, make my way home, have some food to eat start all over again later me gone, me gone, me gone me gone, me gone